More Seth Rogen went on a Twitter spree on Monday for the 10-year anniversary of the stoner film, Pineapple Express, and it led to a pretty shocking revelation producer Judd Apatow turned down actor Brian Cranston for a role in the movie as a drug dealer because he didn't seem scary enough to seem like a real drug dealer. Rogen shared a slew of fun tidbits about the movie, including that he did 99% of his own stunts in Danny McBride's character, Red had an ex-wife played by Stormy Daniels. But the most interesting fact was shared by Apatow, in response to one Rogan's tweets so you've got one. Brian Cranston auditioned. He may have even read at a table read and I said I don't think he seems scary enough to seem like a real drug dealer. If he did pee maybe the Breaking Bad people would have said, not him, he always plays drug dealers. https slash slash t dot co slash pr 2 qh Judd Apatow at Judd Apatow August 7, 2018 Cranston fans will surely find this anecdote both laughable and totally false, considering the actor's iconic tenure as Walter White in AMC's Breaking Bad. Dot is White, Cranston plays a chemistry teacher turned meth maker who gets increasingly bloodthirsty over the course of five seasons. The show premiered in 2008, the same year that Pineapple Express came out. Dot while season 1 Cranston might have fit Apatow's description of not scary enough. The Cranston of season 5 would have far surpassed his in expectations. The drug dealer role Cranston auditioned for ultimately went to Gary Cole, who does a pretty damn convincing job of being both unhinged and believable. Well, luckily the loss of Cranston for Pineapple Express was still our gain.